Caleb, thank you. A man accused of shooting and killing two people in West Palm Beach is on trial right now. Josie Carbonari was in the courtroom and joins us live now. And Josie, detectives presented their evidence against Kenneth Hawthorne today. That's right, and Aaron, this was the second day of testimonies. Jurors were shown some pretty gruesome photos of the victims, and we also heard from CSI detectives walking us through everything that they saw from the scene. In this video, you can see an assisting arresting officer uh, showing exactly what happened to the courtroom and jury of 12. West Palm Beach Police Sergeant Adam Myers talked about responding to the scene in 2017, where Kenneth Hawthorne, now 28 years old, had been pulled over in his silver Jeep blocks away from the Caribbean Villa apartments where police say he shot and killed two people while playing video games and shot another who called 911 and survived. Sergeant Myers talked about handcuffing Hawthorne and seeing a nine millimeter gun in the front seat. He described that gun falling out of Hawthorne's lap and onto the pavement during the arrest. That same gun matching casings found in the home where the men were shot. Another CSI detective calling Salzer also taking the stand going slide by slide and Prosecutors showed images from the crime scene as she described the trail of blood splatter and evidence going from room to room at times showing victims in the photos and how they were each found at the home where the shootings happened. Now, Kenneth Hawthorne faces two counts of first degree murder and one count of attempted murder. We're told deliberations are expected to begin as early as tomorrow afternoon. Reporting from the Palm Beach County Courthouse, I'm Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News.